because of the size of the tabletop, I'm going to glue it up in two separate sections. I'll glue what I call the A and the B together. The C is over here on the table. Now the, uh, the width of this right now is just over 37 inches, so I'm going to trim an inch off of what I'm calling the C side. And I, I picked that one because I looked at the character of the top of the table and that edge had the least amount of character, so I'm going to peel an inch of that off and that'll help to, I don't know, expand the interest of the table, get rid of the, the dull part and just keep the interesting part. Now I've got on top of this 19 biscuits uh, slots cut and this is a, a beechwood biscuit right here. The beechwood biscuit will get glued into the slots and it helps to bind it all together. There's not a lot of open time with this glue, so I kind of have to work fast. So I'm going to get busy. I'm going to leave that on and I'll edit it later. The other thing I did here is I actually cut two slots for biscuits into the top and I have them offset. The idea here is that the, the piece is so thick at almost one and three quarter inches that um, I didn't want to put a biscuit right in the middle. I wanted to put one about half an inch from each side. So that's what I did. First biscuit in, glue it up, and just keep moving. Beechwood biscuit swells a little bit when it gets uh, glue on it, when it gets wet. So I kind of have to keep this going. There's going to be some squeeze out of glue, but I don't want too much. The other thing is I want a piece of scrap as I glue because this is a soft wood and pine will get damaged very easily. So I want to take as much care as I can as I work with it. too worried about the end here because I will be cutting it off.
That's better. My witness marks were off, and that meant that the biscuits were not going in flush the way they should. <laughs> 